Hey everyone, uh, I know this is kind of a different video than, excuse you, hush. I know this is kind of a different video than the ones that I've been making lately. Um, I know that probably a lot of you are here because of the, I think, three video essays that I put up. Uh, and I know I had mentioned that I was putting up another video essay on uh, professional wrestlers in film. And that's not going to happen. Um, I kind of lost the desire to do it uh, because the editing for it just wasn't... The way that I wanted to edit it, I ended up not enjoying. Uh, and then just, I don't know, the topic didn't really hit me as hard as the topics in the previous video essays that I had made. So for now, I think I'm just going to kind of take a break on those. Uh, and I'm not sure what else I'm going to make. Uh, other than this, because I think we all kind of need a distraction right now, um, especially if you're an American. Uh, we need something to take our minds off of everything going on in the real world. And so that's why we have the internet. Uh, so if this isn't your jam and you're really not into this and, you know, you're only here for like video essays, I totally understand please feel free to click away. Uh, I hopefully will have another one out at some point. I'm not sure what it's going to be on. I have a couple of ideas in my head, but for now, I'm just kind of trying to figure out what I want to do with this channel. Uh, but yeah, again, if you were just here for that and you're not interested in any of this, no hard feelings. Move along. Uh, because today, what we're going to do is we are going to be playing The Sims. Specifically, we're going to be doing something that I've wanted to do for a while, which is play professional wrestlers in The Sims. And I know what you're saying. Venti. That seems kind of weird. That seems a little bit parasocial. That seems a little bit cringe. And it is. But I think it's going to be funny. So I'm going to do it. Anyway, the wrestler that I want to uh, play in this game, I actually was trying to decide between two of them. Uh, one of them was Adam Cole, and that is the wrestler that we are going to be making. However, the other wrestler that I really wanted to make was Claudio Castagnoli. And I thought to myself, well, why choose between the two? So they're going to be roommates. So today we're going to be making Adam Cole and Claudio in The Sims, uh, hopefully in this video we get to the homemaking stuff, because that's honestly why I watch a lot of The Sims. I love watching people make the houses. Uh, and they're going to be roommates. And then we're going to see what happens from there. Uh, so let's get started in this. Uh, hello, my name is... We're going to make Adam Cole first. Nope. Your last name goes up here. Do, do, do. Uh, so the other thing I want to point out is that I'm going to be making like the characters Adam Cole and Claudio. I'm not making like the real life people. We're not getting that weird and parasocial. Uh, and we're also going to be playing them in the Sims universe. So uh, I'm going to kind of show you what I mean about that in a second. Um, we're not going to pick a cause of death. He's not dead just yet. Unless. No. Later. We'll do that later. All right, um, so select an aspiration. So I don't necessarily want to make them pro wrestlers in The Sims, one, because I don't think you can, and two, because I want to see, like, if you take the pro wrestlers and put them in The Sims universe, like, what would they do? And they wouldn't necessarily always be athletes. So for Adam Cole, uh, what do we think he would, his aspiration would be? Right? So outside of professional wrestling. Uh, let's see. He's not a nature fortune guy, I don't think. Deviance? Possibly. I like the idea of a deviant Adam Cole. Performs stronger and more successful with mean interactions. You know what? Let's... Hmm, I'm stuck between deviance and popularity. Let's do, you know, Adam Cole. I think Adam Cole is more deviance because I think Claudio is more popularity because, you know, gregarious and friendly and whatnot. So for now, 
we'll do oh my god there's sub options i haven't played the sims in a while so like i didn't realize all right villainous valentine this sim wants to destroy the love lives of all sims including their own this sim wants to make enemies and be a famous criminal this sim is all about pranks and mayhem okay Ooh, public enemy seems very like adam cole like roh adam cole coded and nxt and aew and uh, we're gonna do public yep public enemy yep okay cool pick preferences now all right activities uh oh god do i have to do all of these okay i think that's good i think we're fine with that all right pick a trait so here is where we have to be really careful because adam cole is kind of a, a nuanced character right so i think self-assured for sure has to be one of them uh let's see second trait Art lover, bookworm, foodie. Ah, uh, none of these really strike me as, yeah, mm, eh. Um, active, kleptomaniac, neat. Uh, well, active. I would. Mm, let's see what the other ones are. I, I have to refresh myself. Um, family oriented, evil. Ooh. Now, is Adam Cole evil or is he just mean? I mean, it's Adam, it's Adam Cole. He's evil. Okay, perfect. Makes sense. All right, next one. Uh, last trait. Jealous, loner, non -com I don't want to give him all negative traits, right? Let's give him like something, let's give him something nice, right? Um, cheerful. What do we say about cheerful? I think cheerful is fair. I think that's, you know, perfect. Pick an occult. Oh, that's right. Okay, so the uh, expansion packs that I have on this, I have Vampire, I have the Holiday one, and I'm gonna get Seasons eventually. Um, it's not on here right now, but it'll probably be in later videos if I end up making more of this. Um, but no, I, I won't make him a vampire right now, right? Like, let's... Let's slow our roll, okay? All right, Adam Cole's skin tone. We're going to do the non-spray tanned skin tone because they don't have spray tan in here. They should have spray tan as an option in The Sims. Oh my god. Could make the young bucks. All right. All right. What would Adam... So Adam Cole's natural skin tone. He's kind of a pale guy, right? I think... I think this is fair. I think this is a fair... Oh, my light fell. Stay. Did that help? I don't know if it helps any. I I think that's... I. So I don't actually have a light. I'm about to reveal myself. Um, It's just my phone camera. So uh, it's gonna... It falls all the time. So we're gonna... We're gonna replace that. Does it look good here? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Is that good? I look a little spooky. Whatever, we're gonna go with it. Um, I think this is good. I think this is a good Adam Cole skin tone. All right, um, so I'm probably gonna fast forward through a little bit of the rest so that you don't have to sit and watch me like pick over every small thing between Adam Cole and Claudio because we've got two sims to make and a house to build today. So let's get going, all right? <laughs> Cole's got that like long luscious hair that's not that's not it that's not it that ain't it chief that's also not no he's got like a dirty blonde kind of hair about like uh oh he's got it's like something between this and this is his hair I think I'm going to go for the browner one and see how I like it. And if anyone throws a fit and people say, you know, that that's that's not his hair, I'll go back and change it. But we're going to go. I think that's pretty fair. Um, okay, so let's, we need to give him, that's not it. We need to give him, like, I don't think they have any down hair that looks very good for Adam Cole. 
So we need to get like see if they have a bun, like a man bun or something. Um, let's see. With the packs that I have right now, I'm sure that there are other expansion packs that have more hair. Uh, but we're working with what we're working with right now. Um, no. No, no, no. Uh, no. Why does it, why are his cheekbones look like that? Okay. Um, come on. Let's get those cheekbones to look like he's a human. There we go. Um, actually, you know what? That hair that we were just on that has like the little low pony, I actually kind of dig that one. Where is it? Is it this one? It is. It's this one. Honestly, I kind of dig this one. This is very like ROH Adam Cole, like before his hair got super long. I kind of dig that. He doesn't usually have a low pony, but you know, we're working with what we're working with right now. Okay. I think this is pretty good. I think he's got a, th a thinner face than this. Like a, a... Oh, there we go. You can like move the, the head. Yeah, there we go. Okay, I think that's a little bit better. I think the facial hair is going to change a lot for us. I think it's really going to like have an impact. So which Adam Cole facial hair do we go with? I don't think ROH this Adam Cole. I don't think that I'm driving with that necessarily. So I think, but also not like the long, long bearded. What about, ooh, this is very good. I think this is pretty Adam Cole, right? Or is this more Claudio? Ooh, it's gonna be difficult because, oh, I think that might be more Claudio. I think this is more Adam Cole. I think this is more Claudio, right? Yeah. Let's go, you know what, let's go with this. Let's go with that. I like that. Okay. Um, I don't think I'm going to give him any hats, except for when it's cold, when it's chilly outside, I would like to give him a little hat. I would like to give him a little beanie. Or, oh, Adam Cole in a little cat hat. Oh, Adam Cole in a little calico cat hat. Oh. <gasps> Yes, it's my game, and I don't care if you think that he would be in this or not. This is going to be my one, um, uh, my demand. He's in the little cat hat. Uh, now, from what I do remember in The Sims, I usually go through and I get rid of all the accessories um, going through here because they're all hideous. And if you're not paying attention, sometimes you'll forget that they're there. Um, okay. I think that's good with his face. Let's go with the body yaddy. Okay. Now, Adam Cole, I think, would wear character Adam Cole, not Adam Adam Cole, right? So let's do... He's been beaten to the leather jacket. He's worn that a couple of times. Something kind of like this, I think, right? But it's like, it's black because he's, you know. Ooh, or the flannel. How do we feel about the flannel? Ooh, actually this, this feels very, hmm. What about, I do kind of like this. I like the, hmm. It's been a lot of leather jackets for him lately, ever since, you know, he ripped out MJF's heart. I think, I think we go with this. I think, I think we go with this. And he has some, some like dark jeans. Oh, those aren't jeans. Jesus Christ. What are those? Um... Okay, we're on to Claudio now. Now, let's see. Claudio's aspiration. What is Claudio's aspiration? Thinking about his character, right? And his character right now, he's in the Death Riders. They'll always be BCC to me. Um, what do we think his aspirations are? Kind of like overall, right? I think, hmm. 
I think athletic. I think no matter what you do, no matter where you go, I think athletic, like, no matter what version of Claudio's character you have, I think athletic is, you know, the what well, I didn't even see the default character that they gave him. Hold on. I can't look at this. Uh, let's first. Before I forget this. How do I... I, I, random, how do I randomize? No, I don't want to randomize the traits. I want to randomize what he looks like. Are you, can you not do that anymore? Am I just fucking stupid? Oh, no, you just do this. No, no. That's probably as close as we're going to get before I actually put things in. All right. I think he does like comedy. I think he does like cooking and fitness. I think that's very good for his character. I think he does like mischief. I think he does like mixology. I think perhaps he doesn't like gardening. Does like video games. Maybe rocket science? In program? I think he's a smart guy. I think we make him kind of a, you know. It's Claudio. He's good at basically everything. Uh... No guitar. He said before he's not good at instruments. All right. I think that's good. Sorry, I'm kind of like blowing through these because TVH, I want to get to the building the house part. Um, music? Music, he'll figure it out as we go. I think that they do, like, when you're in world, I think they still let you, like, you know, figure out what you do and do not like. All right. Let's do traits now. Okay. Claudio. I would say Claudio is, I wouldn't say hot-headed, genius, I mean, he's really smart, I'm gonna put genius in the back pocket, I think genius, maybe, <sighs> ambitious, do we think he's ambitious, hmm, I think ambitious, I would say ambitious for Claudio, for sure, um, okay. Let's see. Can't, okay, he can't be lazy. That's a fix with ambitious. That's interesting. Okay. Um, I think active. I think we have to say he's active. Uh, now, the last trait, I know which one I want to use for him. Uh, I think maybe evil. I think, I think maybe evil for Cole and Claudio. Because when you look at their, like, characters right now, it's either evil or mean. I can lean more towards mean for Claudio right now. Um, I can be convinced into Claudio. Uh, they become confident after winning a fight. They become happy when being mean or mischievous. Uh, with negative moonlits, can laugh maniacally. Ah, uh, I don't know. Okay, you know what? I think mean. I think mean fits. Okay. All right. Now, speed run. Okay. So we did kind of rush through a little bit of that, uh, but basically I got everything done. Uh, now we are moving on to the part that everyone actually cares about, which is we're going to make these guys a house. Uh, what do we want to call their household? I mean, should we Dan and Phil style just mix their names together, right? So, Adam Cole, Castagnoli, 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 Castagnoli? Castagnoli, Coley. Yep. Perfect. I'm a genius. So smart. That's what you guys followed me for. It's because I'm me. I'm a thinker. Um, okay. So I don't think they would live in Forgotten Hollow. I think that's a little too spooky for them. Newcrest, maybe. Oasis Springs, I think possibly. Because, you know, it's kind of, well, mm. Willow Creek, Marshy Riverways, Bayou. Ah, I don't know. I'm feeling, I think Newcrest. 
I think Newcrest is kind of the fun area from what I remember. Oh no, this isn't the area I remember. No, this is the more residential area. So then is it Willow Creek that I'm thinking about? It is. Okay. Willow Creek is what I'm thinking about. Okay. We are now at the part where we are choosing a lot. Now, before anyone does anything, I want to say that the only time I'm going to be using a cheat code in this game is initially when we decide on what house it is, and I'm going to use the motherload cheat, but I'm only going to use it one time, okay? It, I'm going to use the cheat one time, and that's because I think if these two move in together, they're probably going to have some funds between them. Also because I want to make a really pretty house right off the bat. I'm not going to go crazy. I'm going to use the motherload cheat. I'm going to use it one time, right? So it's an extra 50,000 simoleons. And that's it. That's it. That's the only time I'm going to be using that cheat. Other than that, they make their own way, okay? So let's just put that out there right now. Um, I also, if you'll notice by looking at them, forgot to change their body types um, because I forgot that that's a thing that you can do. So I'm going to go back and do that uh, once we decide this lot. So if you see any sudden change in what The Sims looks like, that's why. Um, so let's, I'm drawn to this lot because it's pretty big. And it's near a riverway. It's like kind of close to these things over here. This lot. Oh my God. Why is it so expensive? Oh, cause I guess it's even, it's even bigger than, no, no, no. It's the same one. So why is this one more expensive? We're not going to do that. That's stupid. All right. And then, okay, this is the cheapest one, but they're all basically the same. Oh, I guess it's probably the shape of the lot, right? I mean, if we go for this one, it looks like I could make their house and give them a lot of outside space. And then they're like right across the street from all of this. Yeah, you know what? Fellas, we're moving into Bargain Bend. All right, now, hold on. Before we do anything, pause, okay? No, 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 not go home. Actions, no. How do I, I used to, you used to be able to like edit this sim. Oh, I think it's only if I have a mirror. Okay, whatever, we'll go back and fix it. I mean, Colt looks pretty close to how he looks now. And I think I just need to make Claudio more muscular. I think that's about it. All right, I'll do that later. For now, we're in build mode, folks. Okay. So, actually, no, we're not in build mode. We're going to do the cheat, and we're going to do the cheat once. Does it still work? And it does still work. All right. Okay. We've done the cheat, and that's it. It's the only cheat we're going to do in the game. That's it. Unless, well, there's one cheat I'm thinking of, but... No, we're not going to, we're, we're not going to go there. This game's, not, it's not going to get weird. Okay. It's not going to get weird. I know you're thinking like, oh, there's some like weird things that I could do. It's not going to get weird. Okay. It's not, it's not. Huh. Okay. First, let's build these walls. Um, I think, so I want to leave them some space over here, right? Cause I think that. Unless I want to make a long house. Do we want to make a long house and then leave them some outdoor space over here? Maybe. Because we can have one half of the house be like kitchen, living room, and all that. And then the other half be like their actual rooms. Because I don't think even with 70,000 simoleons that we're going to be able to afford an upstairs. So I think maybe we do... For now, a farmhouse, one story, and then give them some outdoor space over here, right? Because we don't want their outdoor space to be, like, all right here. Because, you know, nosy neighbors and all that. So I think we make a nice square house. I think we start here, here, here. I think we start here, and I think going to about there... I think that's good. I think that's a good, yeah, I think that's a good choice. Okay. 
Then we're going to go back and I do, I want to leave them some space there. So we'll go here. All right. And then let me make sure I'm lining this up right. Okay, perfect. So I think this is, I think this is a fair amount of space, right? So we'll have them walk in. I think we have, we need two bedrooms because we're not making it weird. We're going to have two bedrooms. So I think maybe... Maybe they're like side by side bedrooms. You know what I'm saying? So like have the bedrooms be like over here. Right. And then we can split them to make sure that they're even one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh God. Oh God. Oh, I've made a mistake. Oh, I've made a mistake. Oh, I've made a mistake. We can fix this. We can fix this mistake. We can fix this mistake. We can fix this mistake. Mistake fixed. It never happened. None of you ever saw it happen. Okay, perfect. So. There you go. Now we've got two bedrooms. And so then I think I'm going to leave the rest open. Okay. Um, one thing I did see someone do uh, is made a little like cutout in the side of the house like here for like a little reading nook i think that was very cute so we're gonna do one of those um and then what you do is you delete like these exterior walls here yes oh perfect it works let's go okay so then this can be like a little reading nook all right okay so this so far, do I actually want to extend it out a little bit? Because this is a lot of space over here. Let's, uh, you know what, let's extend it out a couple so that they can have their own individual bathrooms. Right? Because I think that's the like big mistake I always make is I make everything and then forget that they um, also have to have bathrooms. So we'll give them both like a small bathroom attached to their room because they're grown men right they need their privacy okay i think that's pretty nice right i think that looks good right two bedrooms two bathrooms all right uh now so what do we want this house to look like i want to give them some windows well, we should probably actually do the door first, right? So a front door. So what does their front door look like? Um, we can do a single, simple front door. I kind of like this. Um, I think I, I think these two would have a nice, simple front door initially, right? So uh, multi-pane window. I, unpopular opinion, I don't like front doors that have windows in them. Feels like an invasion of privacy. Also feels like an easy way for criminals to get in. So we're gonna we're not gonna do that. No criminals are gonna be getting in. All right. Now, granted, maybe they're the criminals, but who knows? Um, okay. So I think the door. I think a white door, right? I think a white door is pretty simple. Um. Oh, hold on. Let me put the walls down so I can see where this front door is even going. Front door can go here. That feels good. Okay. All right. Uh, front door. And then what is the exterior? What do we want the exterior to look like before we do anything else? Uh, wallpaper. Pan I, no paneling. No siding. Siding looks gross. Masonry. <gasps> Rock and stone. Ooh. Ooh, that looks lovely. Have you ever seen a house that looked like that? Ooh, you've never seen a house that looked like that. Ooh, that looks nice, though. Ooh, that looks nice, though. Yeah, I like that. Okay, I think we're going to go with that. I think that's very nice. All right. Perfect. 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 All right. Oh, that's what a lovely little house that looks like. All right. 
Actually, this little nook right here, maybe I want this nook to have a different siding. Maybe I want this to have like the, the actual, like the white siding, right? Or maybe like a, like something like this where it's kind of like grayish. Oh, I want to find it. Does, is there not a gray that matches that gray though? Oh, there isn't. Shoot. What if I do like, um, hmm. What does the paneling look like? Oh, that's nice. I think it may be too rich for their blood though. It's nice, but I think it's too rich for their blood. What's Sweet Pea look like? Hmm. Again, I don't think that there's a gray that necessarily matches. Yeah, there's not a gray that's light enough. Retro Lux, what does that look like? No, don't like that. Um, Pinstripe Grains. Ooh, do I like that? That looks kind of like modern. I like it. I don't know if I like it in the black though. What if we do like a, a white, see that? That feels kind of modern. I kind of like that. Do I want it in that or do I want it as like that? Ooh, or that. Uh, no, I don't like that color. All right, it's either that or that in the black. I kind of like it in the black. It feels kind of like mod. Okay, I like that. I like that for their little reading nook, perfect. Okay, windows. We're gonna need some windows. Oh, actually also what I wanna do is I want to give it some foundation. All right, final decision, it's lifted. All right, foundations, let's give them what kind of like nice, I'm hesitant to do more masonry because I don't want the stone, see the stone would interact with that. What if we just do like the Armageddon? The Armageddon is kind of close to what they have now anyway, right? What's this? Oh, it's stilts? That's cool. What about this? Well, no, I, don't, I think that clashes a little bit. What if we do one of these, right? Ooh with like a nice, like a black, ooh. Okay, I kind of like that, but not in that like, ooh, yeah, something like that. Do we like that? I mean, it's gonna be covered, my plan is I'm gonna cover it with a, um. I'm gonna cover most of it with the porch anyway. So we won't have to worry about it too much. Okay, perfect. Now, we're going to give them a wraparound porch. And I think to do that, you do like one of these, right? Square. Oh, it just gives you a straight up, like it'll give you a deck. Perfect. Oh, perfect. You don't even have to. Oh, that's nice. No, what did I just do? Undo that. Undo whatever I just did. What is that? No, undo that. What is that? Oh God, there's so many boxes. There's so much to focus on right now. Okay. I want that like that so that I can still add in a stairway. But we're gonna bring you out to like here. Okay. And then we're gonna bring you out to here. And then I think I want to leave this flat because I want to give them a pool in the back. So I think it's going to like go down into like a flat area over there. But they're going to have all that space to do something over there. And then I want to stretch this out over here. Perfect. Okay. Lovely. Now, can I apply that foundation that they have there to here? I can. Perfect. Okay. And we're going to change these railings because i do not like these railings these railings are ugly what about this uh too gothic for them what about this how does this look uh almost exactly the same thing uh that one's okay that one's a maybe 
Uh, do I like this? Do I, do they have it in a gray? Ooh, do I like that? No. I think the problem is this section of the game is going to be so long because I'm so picky about like this. I kind of want it to match the foundation. Do they have it in a black? Ooh, I kind of like that. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? Are you seeing? Is everyone seeing my vision? I hope everyone's seeing my vision. Do I like that? Do I like that? I think I need to put the roof on to, to decide if I like it or not. Because we've got, I mean, the prairie stat. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, I do like that. Oh, I do like that very much. Now it's a lot of their money, right? Is the thing. And I know you're saying, hey, that's a lot of their money to spend on just a railing. But hear me out. They deserve it. No. <gasps> what have I done? Just want to get rid of that. There we go. Okay. Um, and then I also want to give them an exit right over here. Perfect. Okay. Good, 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 good. Everything is working out. Everything is going fine. Now I need to make them stairs. Extend you out here, here, and then where did my door go? Hey, does anyone know where my door went? Where's my door? Door went away. It's weird. Give me their door back. Actually, now that I think about it, the door should be black. Perfect. Okay. Um, now these stairs should be black also. That doesn't look black. That looks gray is what that looks. Okay. I don't like the color black that that turns. There we go. That's perfect. Okay. Okay, I like this. I like this so far. I think we make the deck. Where's the wood? There we go. Uh, what if we make the deck like a nice, like a light wood? And then I, oh, but the stairs. Oh, but the stairs. Oh. I can get down with this one. Okay, I like this one. Perfect, okay. So, now we've got the nice wraparound deck. Oh, I'm gonna have to put stairs back here. It's fine. We can put the stairs back here as well. Oh, there we go, perfect. Awesome. Okay, there we go. Lovely. Ah, uh, everything I wanted from it. Okay, now roof, then window, then indoors. So roof, what if we do like, um, like one of these? No, I don't like the diagonally. I don't like the one that's diagonal. Hipped roof? I think that's a safe bet for now. A nice, like, hipped roof. And then we'll do one of these. And one of these. Uh, we're gonna have to pull it out a little bit more, actually. Um, and I'm okay with having that there. Actually, since that is there, let's kind of cover it a little bit if we can. There we go. Okay. Um, now roof trim. I think the trim of the roof should be black. I think we are kind of on that. And then roof pattern. Uh, what that is, what do their neighbors have? Neighbors have a nice little scalloped one, but we don't want to copy the neighbors. Uh, that's cute, but it's kind of meh. Uh, that looks okay. What about like a... Oh, no, that doesn't match the rest of the house. 
Do we do? Do we want to match the name? I think we want to match the neighbors. Okay, but I don't want it to be black necessarily. What if we make it like a. Uh... Ooh, yeah. Ooh, I like that. That looks nice. Well, hmm. Does it look nice? Listen, guys, I'm not an interior designer, right? I think that's pretty evident. Um, but what I am is extremely particular. Oh, now I'm kind of rethinking what I cited the house as. Because now it's going to be so hard to pick a roof. I almost kind of want to go with the OG one that they gave us. Or make it black. Hmm. Let me, like, adjust where this is again. Because I still think it's... Yeah, I think it was a little too far out from the house. <sighs> I kind of like it. That one, no, not definitely not that one. Not hay. Gravel? Ew. Oh, bleh. that one made me want to throw up. I never want to look at that one again. Okay, I, I take it back. I kind of like how this looks. I'm not married to the black, though, and it doesn't have it in another color. What about this one and, like, the... Mm, no. You know what? I think I'm going with this one for now. I think, I think we do this one for now, and then if I change my mind later, we can always fix it. So, now we've done the roof. Let's get some window action going on. All right, I think for this lovely house, right? I don't want it to be all black. I think these guys have kind of like a nice, like a, I want it to match, I want the windows to match the railing is what I want. I want the windows to match the railing. So what if we do like one of, why won't you? Oh, it probably intersects with the other room. Um, I like these. I think this these windows are kind of cute. So let's do a wall down view now, right? I think here, because I'll put, oh, I'll put one window here for the bedroom, right? And then, so that's one, two, three, I think one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and then putting it right here. I think that's about even, right? And then we can put another two where the bathrooms are. So put that one there. That's about in the middle. <gasps> the rooms are uneven again. The rooms are uneven again. The rooms, the rooms are uneven again. Hold on. The rooms are uneven again. Oh no. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. The rooms are going to be uneven. All right. Well, someone's going to have to get the smaller room. Someone's just going to have to get the smaller room. I'm not redoing all that shit. All right. Anyway, back to the windows. Okay. So now for this side one, I want tall windows. Ooh, like one of the... Oh, it's two. Yeah, it won't fit. Um, What about like a farm... It won't fit. Uh, what kind of... Do you... Oh, that. see, that would be perfect if that could like fit inside that. Hello, Bing Bong. You are fat. Okay. Um, ooh, what's this? Mega window. It's 210 simoleons. We haven't even started decorating the inside. All right. I think we're going to need a skinny window. Yeah, I think we're going to need something like that. I think we're going to need three of those. Yeah. Ooh, I like that. Ooh, that looks nice. Okay. Let's do a wall down view. I think that's good. I think that's plenty window for this house. Yeah. Okay. I think it's time to start decorating the inside. So first things first, first thing that I always used to do when I was making the Sims was I would 
put in the saucers. Let's see, where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Here we go. Perfect. Okay. It's fine if they're gray. Um, put these guys in. Because every house has them, right? Binks, my sweet, loving boy, as adorable as you are, and as much as I do love you, I don't want your butthole in my face. And I know that that is something hurtful to you. I know it's hurtful to you when I say that. But I don't want your butthole in my face. Look at him. Little Binks break. Okay, and down we go. Okay, I think we're gonna do three rows of these. Where is that? Are you even, hold on, what am I looking at? You're even right there, perfect. Okay, we're gonna do three rows of those. And then I think the bathrooms and the rooms get their own lighting, right? Uh, so I think, what kind of lighting do I want for? I think we give Cole the smaller room. I hate to say it, Claudio's older though. I think Cole gets the smaller room. Um, look at this little cloud lamp, what? Look at this little cloud lamp. Oh, I, I kind of want to give Cole the little cloud lamp. I'm gonna give him a little cloud lamp. I'm gonna put it right above the window too. All right, um, but he's also getting probably another lighting fixture at some point but what do we want to put in the bathroom um put that right here because i'll probably end up putting the like mirror and whatnot right there yeah okay and then we'll put um cutlass of light uh and then maybe like an overhead light like another saucer probably in the bathroom but just the well yeah we'll do the smaller saucer in the bathroom Uh, and then we'll probably put one. Is that good, actually? I think that's good. Yeah, okay. And then what I can do is I can just make these parallel. Right? Yeah, I'll just make them parallel. Oh, that's a good idea. Perfect. All right, now where is that light again? Where did I put that? Right here. All right, and then you'll go up here, right where I put the other one. Perfect. Okay. Like a little... Ooh, and it would be black too. Yeah, like one of these. Like right kind of in the... Or maybe two of them, right? Like one here and one here. And then that's like the... Oh, yeah. Oh, you know what I might do? I might move them back. And then where they intersect right here, I think that's where I'm going to put his bed. See, like, it kind of makes this little, like, Venn diagram right here. I think I'm going to put his bed right there. Okay. Um, obviously, I'm going to give him, like, probably a standing light, too, because his room really isn't as lit up as Cole's. And Cole, I think I'm going to, like, put a little dresser here and give him a little light there. But Claudio, since he's got the bigger room, I'll give him a standing light. Uh, let's give him, and what kind of standing light would he have? Again, I, I get like the sleek mod, like, uh, maybe not that. That's a little bit much, but like, uh, I kind of like this one, like this, like pillar light. Ooh, or one of these. Um, hmm. What does this look like? No, that gives me like teenage boy room. Never mind. Uh, I don't like that either. Yeah, you know what? I think probably this. Let's put one of you there, and we'll put one of you there for now. I think that's good. As you can tell, it's almost time for Binks to eat. Which is why he's all up in my business right now. Apologies. Um, I'm gonna do my very best so that you don't get cat butt. All right. Uh, let's do, since we're on bedrooms right now, let's do beds um i kind of want to give them nice beds right because otherwise they get upset and they've got the cash for it so what kind of bed do i think these boys would have i'm thinking varnish bed for coal 
right? And then I think Claudio, I think Claudio would have this like, ooh, this looks nice though. The Utopian, a thousand simoleons, Claudio. Come on now, we're not doing that. I think this is good for Claudio. Yeah, I think that's good for Claudio. Okay. Um, although, 12,000 simoleons. Not that they don't have a ton of simoleons already, but like, Jesus. All right, dressers. Uh, Coles, I don't want to take up a ton of space. So maybe we do like, well, I don't want to give him a child's dresser. Um, what's this? This seems nice. This seems like a... a a nice, like, oh, yeah, like a nice, like, kind of, oh, but I want it to match the bed. Does that kind of match the bed? Not really. About, like, uh, like one of these, kind of, right? Although, Cole, hmm. Do I kind of want to give him one of the, like that? I kind of want to give him this one. Because while we're, like, again, we're doing kind of like the, you know, the characters, not the actual people. It's kind of video gamey, and I feel like Cole still kind of puts some video game stuff in his character. All right, we're going to have that, and we're going to have it against the wall there, because in that corner, I want to put a mirror. I want to put a mirror. There we go. Perfect. Uh, you know, the thing is, I'm not sold on Cole's bed. I don't like it. Um... What kind of bed? I kind of want to give him the utopia, actually, not gonna lie. Or the discretion double bed system. Uh, do, 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 Zero springboarding. We're not making it weird. I don't care about, like, how much sex they can have in this bed. We're not making it weird. Okay? Okay? Let's do this one. 1390. Let's do this one. Perfect. Okay. Now. Uh, end tables. Claudio needs some end tables. Uh, oh, wait, hold on. I didn't give Claudio a dresser. What am I doing? This man needs a dresser. Uh, reclaimed pine wood wardrobe. Ooh. No, I'm not seeing like the, I'm not really seeing that. About like a nice, I think like a tall, slim like white wardrobe i can see like a you know again like he's a classy guy i can see him having something like this and i do want to make their bedrooms parallel because i think that's a cute little like i think that's a cute touch all right and then let's give claudio a mirror uh ooh, that's kind of a cool mirror Ooh, i like that Ooh, with the um with the white there, kind of. Yeah, I'm also not sold on Claudio's bed now. <sighs> what bed do I want Claudio to have? I kind of want Claudio to have the Utopia now. Not gonna lie. That and like the... The black. Ooh, I like that. Yeah, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm satisfied with that. Um, now... End tables. Perfect. All right, and then let's give them some, oh, coal, I wanted to give a standing light. Let's put it right here. Uh, let's give him like a, a, one of like the bedside lights is what I'm thinking. What is this? Into the mood lit lamp. Feeling down, this lamp specifically designed to boost your mood. Ooh, all right, I like that. Let's do that in black. Look at that. And you know what? Screw it, let's give Claudio one. That's so nice. Okay. Um. Clocks, ah, I don't wanna give them a clock. Well, wait, if I don't give them a clock, will they not wake up for work on time? Okay, I'll give them a clock. 
I'll give him Agent Lock. Just in case. We want to make sure these boys are waking up for work on time. All right. Um, now, actually, real quick, I... Well, no, because that one lets off some light. I would kind of want to move these, like... No. Okay. You know what? Screw it. We're leaving it there. Um, I do like the bedrooms being a little bit darker because, you know, that's where they're going to be, like, napping. That's where they're going to be resting. Um, now, posters... Let's see. What kind of posters do I think they would have in their room? Cole? I still think character Cole would have some, like, video game posters. So let's see if we can find... This looks like a video game, right? Uh, oh, no, it's an inspirational poster. This looks like a... I mean, it looks like a, a Fallout poster. Let's do that, and then let's do a... Uh, Cow plant love. Uh, let's do one of these. Why not? I mean, he's a nerd, right? Like, that's... I'm gonna make him a nerd. Alright. Uh, and then Claudio. I think Claudio would have some, like, professionally framed, like, nerd posters. Some, like, really, like, nicely framed stuff. So let's look for... I think this... Yeah, that looks about right. Uh, or, hmm, well, character Claudio may have something like a Roman temple right now, because he's all about, like, the one true king and all of that. So I think we put that there, and then I think maybe we give him, uh, I think maybe that's it. I think maybe that's good for now. I'll figure something else out later. I usually, like, add decorations on, uh, so then what we also want to do is we want to give them doors to their bathroom. I have forgotten that in the past and it was an oopsie daisy. Um, yeah, let's just give them a simple black panel door. You'll go there and then you'll go in the same place just over here. Let me make sure. Yep, right there. Okay, perfect. Okay, keeping with the theme. And then toilet perfect okay um and then showers they're gonna have showers because they're full-grown men uh let's do i mean what's the difference between these right unicorn dream shower what if i like put it that way right like next to the well you don't want your shower next to the thing so it would have to go here right I mean, 1,000, so, I mean, they have 48, right? What's this? Oh, and it's a, um, ooh, it's a two-in-one. Do they have it in different colors? Because I don't like the, ooh. I mean, it feels a little too fancy for them. Reliability, three, three. See, the, the, I'm looking at the reliability because... It is so annoying changing these things, right? So I think if I'm going to do anything. Ooh, like a night. Ooh, I like the, um, that looks kind of nice. Ooh, that looks kind of nice. Oh, I would have to, I, okay. I have to make sure that I match the tile in there to the tiled wall. However... I mean, it kind of intersects with that window, though. Yeah, okay. You know what? Let's just do one of these. I think this is a good idea. I think it's nice and simple. I'll have to make sure that I match the tile to the, um, the thing, but... Oh, and I forgot his room is smaller. He's going to have to shower, like, right next to his thing. Oh, that's going to suck. Yeah, well, sorry, Cole, your uh, shower is going to be literally right next to your toilet, but the door to get in is right here, so you shouldn't run into any issues. Um, okay, sinks. I think a nice normal sink, like, uh, I think the raw pedestal. I usually like um, this one. Should I make this black? Do I want to, like, hmm. No, I think bathroom stays all white. Right there, and then the mirror... 
is gonna go. I think maybe we can we can make the mirror black, right? Mirror goes there. Oh, perfect. It's everything I'd hoped it would be. Actually, let's make the mirror white. Let's make the mirror white. I made a final decision. Uh, okay. Oh, no, that's small. Okay, fine. We'll do this one. Oh, but this one doesn't even cut. Oh, it does. Okay, it comes in all white. Perfect. Okay. And then over here. All right. I think that's good. What if I, I mean, it's a cardinal sin, but I'm going to move the window over there so that I can move this over here. Okay, perfect. All right. That seems good. I like this. Okay. This is looking good. So now living room. We're actually, wait, real quick, before, I moved on way too fast. They don't have a toilet paper roll. Um, I don't actually know, has anyone found out what happens if you don't do, like, if you don't put a toilet paper roll in? Like, do they just, like, genuinely not, does it affect their hygiene? I have to imagine it would affect their hygiene, but I also don't know if the game would, like, have thought that far ahead. That seems a little high for a toilet paper roll. We'll put you right there. Perfect. Okay. Um, now let's do... Perfect. Um, let's give them some towels. We'll give them a little towel rack right below the window. That's nice. Uh, we'll give them a little... Oh, medicine cabinet? They'll need a medicine cabinet, I think. So we'll give them a nice medicine cabinet. Uh, we'll put it, like, right there. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, will that be too high for them to reach? Is that, like, really high, like, weirdly high for a medicine cabinet? Should I put it, like, next to the thing here? Uh, let's do that. I think next to the sink makes sense. Okay, kitchen. Uh, the counters don't really matter very much, I think. Uh, although those are ugly as hell, so I don't want those. Um... I do like these because I like the, they look like the, the drawers that have the soft clothes and all drawers should have soft clothes. So let's do that. I like, ooh, I like that look. That's a nice, like rich look. I don't like white cabinets. Um, I think white cabinets just end up getting really dirty. So I think we're going to do this. Yes. And then we'll put you there. Yeah. Okay, let's, it's not going to match the other windows, but it's okay. We're going to be fine. Everyone's, hey, shh, calm down, calm down. Everything's going to be fine. Everyone's going to be okay. Windows up there. All right. Um, the fridge. Let's give them a nice fridge. I think if you're going to spend a lot of money on something, you should spend a lot of money on a fridge. So reliability for this one is eight. What's this? The schmapple? It's 14. I'm not even looking at that one. I said a nice fridge. I didn't say uh, an insane fridge. Ooh, that looks nice. I like that. Yeah, you know what? Let's do it. I'm liking the, the, the kind of brownish aesthetic. We're going to go with that one. Um, now, let's do... I think I'll put the sink there. I like the sink going below a window. So I'm going to put the stove here. I also, I, I think, let's give them a nice stove. London's Choice looks nice. Just saying. And then it can, oh, and look, it matches the thing. Oh, we're doing it. Not even a debate. Um, That's ugly. That's okay. All right. You know what? I, I like this one. I need like a darker... Is this like a good dark brown? Does it match? Do we think it matches? Do we say matching? I say it might match, right? 165. This one's only 200. Does it match better? Oh, yes. Oh, oh my god. Yes. Okay, perfect. Oh, it kind of like overlaps with that window though. Okay, you know what? Screw it. I'm moving the window over here. And then I'm going to lift these windows up.
Okay. Um, so then, let's just use the eyedropper. We're going to put more cabinets here. There we go. That's a good kitchen. That's a nice looking kitchen. Okay, perfect. All right, we're going to need a trash can. I think just a nice, simple trash can, like a generic trash can. Let's put it right here. No, why are you at an angle? I don't want to add an angle. There we go. Um, okay, and then we'll give them a microwave. We'll give them a decent microwave. I think like uh, one of these, put it at the end there. Uh, coffee maker. Claudio needs a coffee maker. So we're gonna, we're, I think we're gonna give him a really nice coffee maker. It's 365 simoleons, but I think it's worth it. We're gonna give him a really nice coffee maker. Um, and we'll put it right there. All right, decorations. Uh, we'll put you right there. I got that as a, as a little reward for doing one of the things here. Uh, utensil holder, sure, why not? Uh, paper towels, they're messy boys. They're gonna need paper towels. Uh, let's see. All right, we'll do more misc decorations in a second. Uh, however, I do want to give them a china cabinet. Not that, like, the hutch is a little bit much. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. I mean, this looks nice. Although I kind of, the mega hutch kind of looks, you know. That looks right, yeah. Put that, oh no, I want to put the bookshelf there. Okay, so this will probably go like, ooh, or do I want to put a bar there? I don't want to put a bar there. Yeah, I think okay. They don't need a they don't need a hutch. And then the most important, we'll put a fire alarm right there. Okay. So they can kind of sit and like look outside and all of that. Um, let's give them a nice sofa. Cuttlefish love seat. Not a love seat. We're not making it weird. Unabashed love seat, not making it weird. Uh, ultimate comfort sofa, unabashed sofa. That looks nice. That looks nice. Eventually, I want the Sims to get, um, like, sectionals, you know what I mean? Um, I'm sure one of the expansion packs has it. I just haven't seen it myself. Um, all right, coffee table. They would have a nice coffee table. These boys would have a good coffee table, like a nice glass coffee table. Let's put it right there. Uh, and then the rug always goes under the coffee table. Uh, what kind of rug do we want? I like, I like the idea of a big rug like this. Right? Like a nice big white rug. Kind of like that. I like that. Ooh, I think that looks nice. I like that. I think that looks nice. Um, let's also put a runner out in front here. Uh, ooh. Do I like the square? Ooh, I like the square. Hold on a second. I like the big square one. With the brown around the corners. Oh, perfect. All right. Um, I also kind of want to give him a fireplace. Don't at me. I just want them to have nice things. Okay? They deserve nice things. I actually kind of like the base model of this. They deserve to have nice things. They're going to have a fireplace right there. Uh, oh, I do want them to have the Grimophone because I want them to be able to summon the Grim Reaper. For normal reasons. Not weird reasons. Normal reasons. They're going to be able to summon the Grim Reaper. For normal reasons. Okay. Um, look at the bunny. Uh, ooh, I do like these guys. These little, like, gnome guys. Yeah, they're gonna get one of the little gnome guys. I like a little gnome guy. Um, any, like, nerd shit that I think that they would like? Why do I feel like Claudio would really like trains? Is that a weird, like, I don't know. I just feel like Claudio would like trains. I think we're almost done here. I want to give them a bookshelf because these are learned men. Uh, do I want them to have like a fancy bookshelf? 
Hmm. No, I want them to have like a good, like a full size, a big full size bookshelf, I think. Oh, I don't like the color of that wood though. What about this one? What about this one? Uh, oh, I like that. We can put him like right there. I like that. I think that's a good idea. Um, oh, I never actually gave them the runner. Let me give them the runner. Uh, ooh, what's this? This is cool. What's this? This is cool. Yo, this shit's dope as hell. Ooh, I like this. Honestly, actually, hold on. I think I want to put this in Cole's room real quick. Um, just because I feel like you would have it. Don't at me. Don't ask me. Don't ask me to explain some of the decisions that I'm making. You can't live in my mind. No, I don't like that. Uh, what about this one? What kind of colors do we got with this boy? Um, mm, eh. Uh, mm, no, I don't like that. Um, God, why are all the runners ugly? That one's okay. Oh, it's green. Oh, the green. You know what? The green, it matches the statues. It's a, we're fine. We'll, we're going to go with it. Okay. Um, and then I also, to kind of like, you know, make them look like know kind of like cool learned men observatory we can afford wait hold on they can afford an observatory hold on a second <gasps> they can afford a little observatory what if i just put that listen 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 don't worry about it don't i said don't worry about it um I want them to have a little like woodworking table, right? Uh, does it come in different colors? It sure does. Do I want to put it there though? That's kind of ugly there, isn't it? Um, I wish that the, the like only piano that they have, well, ooh, we give them like a, a baby grand piano. Thanks, you're going in my lap and you're going to sit there and you're going to be happy and you're going to chill out. Um, you know, maybe we figure out what we want to put there later. Oh, well, let's give him a little bonsai tree. I mean, come on. All right. Now I want to put the bar here, right? Uh, this looks nice. I want it to match the, does that match? Uh, not really. What about this one uh that matches a little bit more yeah okay and then we'll put you there okay i think this area right here work in progress we figure out what we want to put in this area later um now the last thing i wanted to do in terms of furniture was give both the boys gaming desks uh so we're gonna give them like normal just regular run-of-the-mill desks uh, or, hmm, put that there. Uh, Cole gets a gaming chair. Uh, Cole and Claudio, I think, get matching gaming chairs. Uh, just because I think that that's, you know, I think that that's just something that makes sense. Uh, and then, computers. They both get nice PCs. Uh, let's just do, for now, this one and this one. Okay. Uh, cool. Okay. So obviously there's more that needs to be done. I think eventually I want to give them like a dining room table. I want to give them like something that goes over here. Uh, but for now, I think we're good. I think for now we need to do walls and floors and then I think we're done. Uh, so floors for the main room, I think we do, do we want to do a dark wood or do we want to do a light wood? 
What is the light wood? Mm, not that one. Ew, gross. What about a gray? What's the gray wood look like? Uh, ooh, I kind of like that. Bedrooms now. Regular carpet. I think white carpet. I think white carpet for both rooms. I think that that's a good idea. Perfect. Okay. Um, and then, obviously, tile for the bathrooms, comma, however, I want to make sure that I'm matching this tile to that. And I believe, well, I don't want to match the tile on the floor to the tile on the wall. Cool as cucumber. Ooh, I like this. This is cool. <gasps> what if I give them black floor? Yep, we're doing it. We're doing it. I've been recording for two hours. We're doing it. Okay. Walls now. Walls for the bathroom we're going to do first because I need to remember that I need to match the tile to that tile. Which I believe that tile is this one. No. It's smaller even. No. No. Can I not match the tile? Did they give me a tile shower that I can't match the tile? Those bastards. There's no matching tile to it? Oh, you sons of bitches. Okay, fine. Fine. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's fine. We're going to tile the walls. Um, I think white tiled walls. I think white tiled walls make sense. White tiled walls that look about as close to that as possible. All right, paint. Now. Uh, do I want paint or do I want wallpaper? Do I like any of these? I don't know if I like any of these. What's this look like? Uh, uh no, we're gonna, we're gonna have paint in these rooms. Um, Cole's room with the white floor and the black and all of that. Ooh. What if I, no, not brown walls. I'm not going to do that to him. What about like this, right? Like, I think, oh, I think that's nice. I think that's a nice bedroom wall. Hey, you know what I should do also after this? Um, is I should give them doors to their bedrooms. I mean, it's just a thought. Okay. Okay. Claudio's room. What do we want to do for Claudio's room? What if we do like a, what about, ooh, a dark walled room for Claudio? Oh, that's sexy. <gasps> oh, yes. Oh, this is perfect. Oh, this is everything. Oh, I love that. Okay. Yep. Perfect. Easy. Dude, finding that was like, weirdly easy okay now usually the part that i spend the longest time on wallpaper for the rest of the house what about this but like make it a little bit lighter oh ew no mm -mm. no okay maybe we do paint the walls maybe we do like a just kind of like a general about like the basic dark right uh it's a little too light, actually. If I'm gonna paint the walls brown, what about like one of these? Do I like this? Are we just gonna be boring and make the wall? No, ew. Oh, that looks even worse. See, this is why this one tip. <gasps> Wait, is this the color that I want? Ooh, this might be the color that I want. I kind of like this. Because it's not, like, super dark and depressing. <gasps> okay. I think I might like this one. Hmm. I think I kind of like this one. Let me see what else we've got here. What's this? What colors does this come in? Oh, mm, too busy. What about this one? I don't know. I like this one. 
maybe? No, also again, too busy. I kind of like this. I kind of like the, like, I like having this, right? Actually, I want to tile. Can we do a backsplash? Let's do a backsplash, right? Let's do a nice, like, what color do we want the tile to be? Uh, I guess we can only really, well, oh no, we can have a black backsplash. Let's do this, right? I think that's good. Or actually let's, well, no, we don't want to do that. Let's do, what about like one of you? And then just have it back there, right? Do I like this? I think I might like this one. I think I might like where we're at here. I want to definitely do something with this wall. I'm just not sure what yet. Like this space, I think here leaves something like I, I think we need it. I actually, I hate this rug. I've decided I hate the rug. We're, we're going to do this. Don't worry about it. We're going to do this and then we're going to do this. And then we're gonna do one of these. And then we're gonna do this. Um, and then we're gonna do this. Okay. Um, yeah, I think we like figure out what to do here and on these walls here. But I think for the most part, that looks good. Okay, I think that that's good. I think that that is a very good start. I like, I like it. I like it. We're probably going to fiddle some next time, but I like where it is right now. So I think we're going to start off there. I'm going to fix whoever this man is. Um, and then we will give them some careers.